After battling back from 2-0 down in the original tie, Wimbledon hosted Bury at Kings Meadow in a replay which saw the two sides go head-to-head -head for the third time in all competitions this season. Bury came into the match off the back of a 4-1 home loss to Southend at the weekend and their confidence took another blow when they conceded on 27 minutes. Lyle Tyler's enticing ball was slotted home by Paul Robinson. The two teams are separated by just four points in League One. The 1988 Cup winners Wimbledon holding the higher position. There seemed a much bigger golfing class though, as the Dons netted again just five minutes later. Some kamikaze defending, allowing Dean Parrott to score his first from open play this season. Wimbledon were winless in four and hadn't scored in either of their last two, but they made a mockery of that stat by rounding out the half three to the good. Berry's defence capitulated, Robinson provided the assist this time, and Dominic Polian finished for his seventh of the campaign. Berry struggled as much going forwards as they did in defence. Even when Tom Saw's long ball forward bounced kindly for James Vaughan, the former Everton man was first denied by James Shea before blazing the rebound over. The two teams are set to lock horns again in Surrey at the weekend in the league and on this evidence it should be three points for the home team. Wimbledon were far too good. Easy pickings for Polian as he hit a fourth. The visitors hadn't won in ten games in all competitions. This after winning six on the spin in early autumn and they had no answer to the rampant Dons. Taylor got in on the act ten minutes from time shrugging off more half-hearted defending to make it 5-0.